Hi, everybody. Hi, Lydia Padilla. How are you? The first one to join my live. Hola. Hi, everybody. It's Cuckoo Cinchielli Fontaine. Wow, you don't understand, but I, I've been like out of doing like lives on Instagram like forever. So this is technically everybody that is joining right now. Congratulations. This is my first live of 2018. Producer to her, how are you, baby? Wife. Yeah, we need to talk. I hope that you can rest today. Oh, poor producer. She was working on her house like crazy. How's everybody doing? Hello. Oh, my God. So many things like going on right now in the first month of the year on January. Now we're in February, which is my birthday month. Woo! I'm going to turn quinceañera. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Believe it or not, no. Woo! I don't know what is what, what quinceañera means anymore in my life. <laughs> but I'm enjoying my 30th. It's amazing. It's a great and amazing time. Okay. The only canon. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm doing phenomenal. I'm doing fantastic. Hey, Josie, to Argentina. Te amo mucho, mami. I love you so much. Thank you for your, your words of encouragement, uh, encouragement this weekend. I appreciate that. Okay, everybody. Rupert Drag Race Memes. I love you guys. Los quiero mucho, chacalones. <laughs> Ustedes son terribles, pero gracias por el apoyo y el patrocinio para mí y para con todas mis hermanas en el programa de televisión. I'm just saying, like, there's a uh, Latino group on Facebook, RuPaul Drag Race Memes, or Memes, or Memes, and uh, they are crazy. They do a lot of jokes and, you know, memes uh, about the girls and me and um, from the TV show, but it is, it's in a good way. You know what I mean? We laugh. Drag, it's about that. It's to have fun, laugh, and be sickening, or just be shady, okay? So, everybody, this is a real quick live. I just want to say thank you so very much for your love and support to me, to everything that is happening in my career right now as an entertainer. Um, I have an upcoming future projects. Um, and also, I just want to say to all my people, to all my peps in Austin, Texas, for your love and support to me and Kelly Klein for the hosting of the viewing party for Alsa Season 3 at All Cans Harry's Austin, Texas. Thank you so much. It's good to be it's good to be back home. You know what I mean? Um, when all my dreams start, maybe probably like nine years ago, you know? So I feel very happy. I feel very excited. Every Thursday, we are having the viewing parties in Austin, Texas. Um, at 7 p.m., okay? At All Cans Carry, O-C-H, okay? We're having so much fun. We have, we have prices, it's Kelly Klein, it's me. We have local entertainers doing short um, performances, doing the commercials, doing the commercials um, on the viewing party. So it's fun, it's fun. Actually, I just want to say thank you to as well because of the uh, support and love that I have on the, sm oh, the quick smoking campaign in Austin, Texas. Go to my Instagram, I have the video with all the instructions, Okay. It's um, sponsored by the Austin Help um, Department, Austin City of Austin, too, as well. So what can I say? It's good. It's awesome. Okay. Um, uh, thank you so much for support. All Stars um, Season 3, RuPaul Drag Race, the TV show. All my sisters are doing phenomenal. I know. I know. Last episode is crazy. We have a lot of, like, surprising, you know, choices choices but at the same time all the girls are doing phenomenal i mean it's it's on the top five of the most uh tv shows views everywhere we have like three something millions of views on the first episode the second episode have like the same amount of range of viewers that's amazing thank you so very much for support rupaul dark race thank you so much for support all stars season three it's phenomenal you know what i mean and uh, I just want to say hi to a couple of groups. I want to say hi to the RuPaul Drag Race group, the secret group on Facebook, Chile. Um, there's one in Argentina that I say hi. The Brazil, too. Um, I just want to say hi to the Italy group of RuPaul Drag Race on Facebook. Okay. And I think I'm missing a couple of other groups. But thank you so very much. And thank you for, you know, allowing us 
to um, go and just talk with you guys. In my case, I cl- I, I'm very close to my fans of the show, to Miss Amores Cucu, and all, to all the rest of the fans. Without you, we're nothing. You know what I mean? So I, I'm grateful to have you in my life. I'm grateful, and I know I'm talking on behalf of the rest of my sisters of the show. We are more than happy to have you, all of you, all of you, okay? I just want to say um, hi to a couple of my sisters that I have the opportunity to join them. You know, on the chat on the conversations on live Instagram. Alexis, Michelle, te amo, mami. Nina Bonina, you always make me laugh. You're amazing. She's a cat or she's a she's a feline or she's a, a demon. Well, hello. It's Nina Bonina Osama Bin Laden, demonio del diablo. <laughs> I love her. Um, I just want to um, say hi to Chichi Devane. She was wearing my shirt on the second episode. You look good, baby. You look good. Because you're wearing Dolce and Gonzalez. Aka Cynthia Lee Fontaine Cuckoo Fashion. <laughs> um, oh, what else? What else? What else? Oh, I'm coming with a big, huge project. I need your help. I need your help. In the eyes of Aunt Cuckoo. I'm going to need your help, so stay tuned for my social media. I'm going to be posting the details about that project, and I need your help. I need your help. Um, I get a question, and I'm going to start with questions. I just want to say, hi, world. Hi, Cuckoo World. Thank you so very much, in general, to all the entire planet for your love and support, okay? Okay, um... People were asking me about what I think about cis queens or what I think about bio queens or fox queens. I'm going to be very honest with you. I support every single type of drag. Every single type of drag. And let me tell you why. The art of female impressionation. The art of entertainment. The art of drag. It doesn't have any gender or it doesn't have any or, or, um, sexual predisposition. You need to understand if you want to do drag, if you're going to put some makeup, if you're going to look extravaganza, if you're going to put like big hair, or even if you want to wear like short hair, it's like me, okay? Because you know that I wear like a puppeteer <laughs> doll, like my beautiful sister Jean Monsoon. Please, Jeans, I love Jean Monsoon. Support her. Her new f- music video is phenomenal. Her um, new music production is just amazing. It's so good. I love her to death. She's a great comedian. She's a great singer. She's a great actor. Congratulations, baby. And thank you so much for... She's been advocated uh, for cisgender community. She's been advocated for all the LGBTQ community as well, too. Please support my sisters that support my community because I'm advocate for the community as well, too. Thank you. So, I support any type of drag. I do. You don't understand. Even like, I got the opportunity a couple of years ago. One of my friends, she is a, a she identified herself as a female. And she did drag. She looks crazy because I do her makeup. <laughs> but at the same time, that's exactly the main point of view of drag. Hello. Why we have to discriminate against somebody that wants to do drag? Every single human being that have an opportunity to express themselves through drag, do it. That's it. Second, I want to say that maybe probably, you know, there's some obstacles and inconveniences in your life. You don't have to, you, you don't have to quit, you know what I mean? Love your life to the fullest. Even if you wake up n- tomorrow and the mood is like cranky or you don't feel, you know, well, the day have 24 hours. That means... Maybe from the 24 hours, two or three hours of that day, you don't feel comfortable with yourself or whatever. Hey, remember, you have more hours so you can discover what that day is, is going to bring you something new and different. Okay? And I'm going to be um, posting on my Instagram story um, some phone numbers so you can call for counseling for suicidal ideations or more, okay? Because it's normal to feel frustrated because we are human beings. And when we are on this shelf, we can be vulnerable to experience um, 
probably some stuff that are very uncomfortable emotionally and psychologically. But you're not alone. There's resources everywhere, everywhere in the, in the planet. Okay, 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 okay. So this week for me, it's going to be viewing party at All Kings Harry at my home bar, Austin, Texas, y'all. And then I'm going to El Paso, touch. I'm going to be celebrating, um, well, I start celebrating my birthday, even if February 16, the real date of my birthday, Friday, February 16. But I'm going to start, like, you know, doing my tours and celebrating my birthday. It's, I'm going to turn 37. I'm so proud. I'm so healthier. I'm so happy. Yes, I experienced a couple of obstacles and inconveniences in the past, like, five days. Eh, things that happen. But I think I realize, I process, I move on. And my cuckoo is happy to go everywhere to entertain you. Okay? Um, so, it's quite interesting. Oh, tomorrow is going to be my mom's birthday. I'm so happy to have her, al al like, you know, live and alive. And she is pretty, pretty healthier, you know what I mean? So... I'm very happy about all those stuff, okay? I'm very happy. Please, 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 please. I need you to still support Katia, my sister, okay? Um, don't ask her questions. Just only support her. Just tell her how much you love her. Just tell her how much you appreciate a biological woman in RuPaul Track Race. Sometimes asking questions is overwhelming, The best part that you can do, ladies and gentlemen, Miss Amores Cuckoo and all the RuPaul Drag Race fans around the world, is to let them know, hey, bitch, we love you. You're not alone. I'm not going to ask questions. I'm here for you. Okay? So that's the best thing that you can do. And please support the RuPaul Drag Race All-Star Season 3. It's going phenomenal. Um, congratulations to the production. Wow Presence is doing a great job. Mama RuPaul is looking impeccable. Michelle Visage, the rest of the panel judges, crazy, and oh my God. Ross, Tondrick, all of you guys are doing a great, a phenomenal job on this new season of All Stars. I'm so proud to become of the RuPaul Drag Race family because this production is growing, professional, and it's doing a great and amazing job. So congratulations. Applause, applause, applause. I really love the show. I really love the show. And congratulations to Corny Act. On winning Big Brother UK. Oh my God, I'm, I'm, so pl I'm so proud. Because let me tell you something. We, as a drag queen, we are breaking the stereotypes. We are even make ourselves mainstream everywhere. That's amazing. And we want you to be a future drag if you've never experienced drag in your life before, okay? And one more thing, one more thing. I'm going to say this, and I hope... All the candidates that are auditioning for RuPaul Drag Race Season 11 are watching my live right now. Or if not, I know somebody else is going to record it. Because I know there's a lot of bitches recording. Because this bitch is recording. Okay? Please, to the entertainers that are auditioning for Season 11, do not post anything on social media. Okay? And if you have any questions, ask the 110 girls or whatever how many girls are right, right now. For tips for audition, for your audition tape. We want you on the show. We want you to express yourself in drag on the TV show. I want you to tell you before, like, uh, beside the other, um, you know, opportunities or platforms right now, um, on pageants and uh, the local bars and all the stuff, you got the opportunity to audition for RuPaul Drag Race, and it's a life-changing experience. Do not be afraid to audition now. Oh, I'm going to wait till next season because I'm not prepared. Bitch! Do you know how many audition applications they are receiving right now at this moment? Thousands and thousands. What are you waiting for? You will regret if you don't take this opportunity now. Even in the future, like, oh, my God, I should audition when Cynthia Lee Fontaine on February 2018. She said under her life, I better, you, I better audition. So, I want you to encourage you to audition. You have to march. Remember, it's a deadline. But this is an opportunity that changed 
that changed everybody else's life that had the opportunity to become part of this show, especially me. So what are you waiting for? Do your application. Wait patiently for your email with all the instructions for your audition. And do it. You never know. You're going to become the next track superstar for season 11, RuPaul Drag Race. And you better win. Because if I know, of course, our drag community in the world is so talented. And I know your audition. And maybe probably you get that one of the finalists and you have to go to All Star Season 4. I'm going to be on Jeopardy. You know what? Because I want to go to All Star Season 4. Shh. Hey. I want to come back. I mean, I want to I, I do the, the uh, you know, they want to see my cuckoo again and again and again and again and again and again and everybody's bothered. And annoying. <laughs> Because I'm back. But I promise. No. You know? If I'm, if I'm coming back, like, for the third time, I don't know. But I promise to those fans that they love me so much. I'm not going to say that word, my brand. I mean, I don't care. If Shangela say hallelujah like me several times, it's because we are proud. You know, returning queens. And proud to be back on the show. And, I mean proud to film. You never know. So, mira. But for everybody that wants to audition for All Stars. <laughs> no, don't audition for All Stars. But everybody wants to audition for RuPaul or Crisis in 11, do it now. Okay? Do your application. Never feel afraid. Remember, don't give up. Even if you have obstacles or inconveniences, inconveniences. Just try to make your dreams come true. Even if you are the only one who believes in yourself. Can I get a hallelujah? Yes. I love you, everybody. I love you. I love you. I love you. I have to go. It's a very short live, but I just want to say thank you so very much for your love and support to me and to the rest of my sisters and to my career. Um, thanks to support my campaign and upcoming projects. Please do not hesitate to follow me on Instagram, Cynthia Lee Fontaine, Twitter, Snapchat, underscore Lee Fontaine, and my two Facebook pages. I got one of my... Facebook pages is like blowing like crazy. So I have a fan page, especially for all of you that wants to follow me and follow my step everywhere. Sausage Valor. Hola, how are you? This is weird. I'm sorry, guys. I tried to say hi to all of you, but apparently my comment section is it freeze on my live. So... I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, Peru, Argentina, Chile, Paraguay, Uruguay, Ecuador, Colombia, Venezuela, I love you. Yes, cuckoo for, cuckoo for, cuckoo for, cuckoo for, we never know, we never know. Also, also, we never know, but if, if they come in the production, and Mama RuPaul are contemplating the possibility to do an Alzheimer's for. Please, 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 please support my other sisters too as well. They are extremely talented. They are gorgeous. They are amazing. But yeah, support me too. <laughs> I love you, everybody. Europe, um, Middle East, Asia, Thailand. This having a RuPaul Drag Race Thailand. Oh, my God. I'm excited. We are mainstream. Drag is mainstream. Everywhere! That's amazing, amazing, amazing. So, what can I say? Brazil, Brazil, lindo, obrigada. Mwah, lindo. Lindo, caralho. <laughs> um, pero los quiero muchísimo a todos ustedes, a mi comunidad hispana. Muchas gracias por tu amor, por tu patrocinio y por siempre estar con nosotros. Hay otro proyecto que voy a estar. Tengo dos proyectos, dos proyectos. Hay uno muy grande que a ustedes les va a encantar y estoy más que agradecido y estoy más que bendecido por ese proyecto que viene. Pronto les voy a... Es más, no, no les voy a dar detalles, se lo voy a dar de sorpresa porque es un proyecto muy bueno. So, there's an upcoming project that I'm telling to my Latin, Latin American um, fans that is coming, but this, that's going to be a huge surprise. There's two projects, so... 
I love you guys. I have to go. Thank you so very much for your love and support. I just want to stop by. It's my first live of 2018. Thank you so very much for your love and support. Thank you for support my pictures. Thank you for support my, my community service project. Thank you for support all my commercial about quit smoking. And there's more to come from St. Lee Fontaine. And remember, whenever you feel sad, whenever you make a mistake, it happens. It happens to me a lot all the time because I'm a human being. Just remember and contemplate the possibility to be positive because you're alive. Life for me is the huge and the biggest inspiration that move my intentions to be a better human being and to be happy. Okay? I love you. I love you so much. I'm going to UK on November. But I can tell you details, okay? And, uh, oh, go to my Instagram. Somebody's asking me about the redemption look. I, I mean, you know, back in the days, my taste of fashion was, like, questionable. Because, <laughs> you know, I was, like, you know, focusing on my personality more on my looks. But now... I got the looks, bitch. Woo! So, if you want to see my redemption look, go to all the way to my Instagram. I post a picture. And it's the fox fur look. Um, uh, and uh, it's gorgeous. And I have the opportunity to collaborate with a Mexican designer fashion house, Abies Who. Look for them on Instagram. Actually, if you go on my Instagram, I tag them. They are phenomenal. They are a new novel, newcomer designers that they have this perspective of architecture and, and you know, design and sense of sensibility for high coach war. It's phenomenal. Just go to my Instagram and look for the picture. That was the Fox um, for fabulous fantasy from episode 5 from RuPaul Dark Race season 9. So that's my redemption. You need to see it. It's sickening. I look like nobody else in the planet. <laughs> so I love you guys. Thank you so very much for your love and support. I have to go. I really have to go right now. But thank you so very much and stay tuned to my social media. I'm coming with great and amazing projects this year. It's going to be fun, okay? Dracon LA, I'm going. Uh, I'm going to be in two panels. I'm going to be in two panels. One is going to be the panel of Miss Congeniality ooh, in Dracon LA. And the other panel is going to be um, talking about Hurricane Maria. And it's going to be um, all the Latinas. And Fifi O'Hara is going to be joining us. Telling us about the experience of the, the big um, fundraiser show that Fifi O'Hara put together in Minneapolis with Chad. That I love Chad. He's a great and amazing producer. Okay. I love you, love you so, so much. Demonio del Diablo, si eso eres tú. Um, I'm a, I'm a mi risa. Oh, my God. Imagínate. Love you, everybody. I love the rest of the fans of RuPaul Drag Race. A todos los fanáticos latinoamericanos, muchísimas gracias por su apoyo, su patrocinio. Los quiero. Y se despide de ustedes, Cucu, Cintia Lifontein, Carlos, Alfonso. Mira, mira. Ingrid, Satanás, ajá, sí, girl, nena, carajo, carajo, cállate, cállate, nobody's talking about religious here, <laughs> no, baby, I'm leaving, I'm saying I'm, I'm leaving, oh, Phillips, how are you, she's a singer, we need to do a live together, I'm not feeling well, I have a little bit of allergies, but maybe probably tomorrow or Wednesday, okay, I love you, she got a great, an amazing voice, Argentina, sos argentino, pibe, sos argentino. No empieces a quitarte la camisa. Valeria Lynch, cuánto la amo. Tuvo un concierto en estos días y gracias a Josie pude ver al algunos videos y pude ver algunos, algunas fotos de su presentación de Valeria Lynch. Fuera de mi vida. Bueno, I love you guys. Thank you so very much. Have a great and amazing time. Continue support the show. Continue support me and my sisters. We appreciate that. Mwah. Love you guys. Love you. Mira the light. Bye, guys. I love you.